Welcome back to the show here and hanging out with Zeke of Town of Frisco. Good morning, sir. How are you doing? Good morning. Hey, well, we are getting ready for the winter season, and the winter season is here at all the resorts, but for Town of Frisco, what they've had, been doing a great job with the last several years is the Tewing Hill. So yeah. how's it going over there? You know, it's, it's going pretty well. You know, we're in the, uh, just like the ski areas, trying to make snow, yeah. trying to get things set. Mm -hmm. And uh, this recent warm spell hasn't been great. It's been great to be outside. Doesn't help, a certainly, during the whatnot, night if you want to make snow, sure. Yeah. But, you know, slow and steady right now is going to win the it race is. for you guys, I think. It and is. just waiting on some of those cold temperatures. But, yeah. you know, and the town of Frisco has done such a great job with the uh, Frisco Adventure Park. So many different unique and uh, cool activities that you can take in during the summertime, but now in the wintertime as well. Wintertime. You know, you have snowshoeing then and Nordic skiing, and then, of course, we the do. tubing. You know what's really neat, Tyler, I think, is that we have the uh, the two below sleigh rides. Right. Two below zero sleigh rides. It's a great outfit. We have Frisco Nordic Center. Mm -hmm. We have Frisco Adventure Park. Mm -hmm. We have the little skiing ride hill school. We have the tubing. You know, we do do some events. Um, you know, it's just it's just a really fun place to bring the family. It's affordable. It's it's a simple location from town, and you don't have to commit the entire day to it, mm -hmm. right? So you can get out there, have some fun, play in the snow, and there's there's just all kinds of different opportunities to go out there and, and just have fun. Yeah, you bet. And uh, like you said, with all the activities there, it would be easy to spend an entire day and family friendly. And uh, you know, the new day lodge that's there. I mean, it's a couple years now old, but yeah. uh, you know, it is still. Uh, fairly new facility there. Well, outside. you know, one thing that's really fun too, and I always, I always fail to mention this is, uh, we rent the building out, and okay. and uh, we do birthday parties, we do holiday parties, um, we do fundraisers, you know, things like that. So it's a really nice spot to go because you feel. In the evening, like you're out in the middle of the wilderness, mm -hmm. and you're still right. You're there, really but, just right across is, the hospital. I you mean, are. Right yeah, exactly. Yeah. I mean, you're close to everything. It's beautiful, though. You mm -hmm. know, I mean, it's it just is. such a beautiful. It's a great shot. There it is. There it is. Yeah. It's a beautiful facility, and it's fun. Yeah. Well, so to go back to tubing here. We're set to open on Thanksgiving, and uh, assuming everything's going according to plan with yep. snowmaking, um, but that's still the tentative date. But uh, with that, then there's some great deals on getting some season passes. We do. We have really good deals. The season passes run through December 15th. Mm -hmm. And we have a family and friends pass, and that's for up to four people. Unlimited tubing. You get some other goodies that go along with it, um, cool. and that's for two forty nine. Wow. And then we have ten punch pass. So if you have family and friends in town and you're not sure, mm -hmm. you can buy that. Um, that starts at one ninety nine. We have a business value pack, which is awesome. Um, you know, for so business. Gifts. Yeah, so oh, how yeah. does that work, though? As a business value pass, only business owners can buy it, or what, what happens? You know, it is for business owners only, but they have the ability then to either A, resell those tickets, okay, um, because they're sold at a discount, of course, okay. um, or they can give them away. You know, it's a great real estate closing deal. It's a, fa a stamp family uh, a f a stocking stuff, or, you know, things mm -hmm. that way. Um, just it's, it's a nice way, you know, valued customers, valued clients. Um, giveaways at a restaurant. I mean, you really, you can do anything with mm -hmm. it that you want to do. Great. Well, yeah. and uh, again, if somebody's a little bit unfamiliar with how to find the Frisco Adventure Park or find out uh, details on these passes, what's the best way to do that? Yeah, townoffrisco.com. Go mm -hmm. to the Frisco Adventure Park. Um, call 970-668-2558. Okay. Um, we're just, like you said, rolling into winter season, so we'll mm -hmm. be open seven days a week. Great. And then, of course, look forward to some great uh, town events coming up also on Thanksgiving, the turkey trot coming the up. The turkey trot, yeah. brand new exactly. annual. Um, I just talked to Lindsay yesterday, and she said she had about 70 people signed up. Awesome. Um, yeah, so it's a fun run. And it's, it's 5K a, through town. It's 5K through town. Mm -hmm. I think you can end up at the Frisco neighborhood. Um, so I think it's going to so be a kick in the pants. Burn, burn some calories before you eat. A before lot you be, calories. Yeah, before you eat. Yeah. 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 Sounds like a good plan. Yeah, and you know what? I think they're going to have wassail there. I yeah, heard nice. the winter. Well, and Wassail awesome. Days is pretty awesome, too, coming, coming up uh, in, in December. December. Yeah, so look forward to that and yeah. find out all the details again right on the website, townfrisco.com. Great. Well, thanks, Zeke, for coming in here today. Thank you, and, sir. And uh, we are going to take a quick break. We are wrapping up the show here shortly. So one more commercial break. We'll be right back after that to uh, round it out. But stick around. More to come.